I keep telling you, man, this kid is a problem when it comes to silver. He's always finding some weird-ish. I don't get it. But before we continue, let's take a moment and just check out who's the only person who can pull off a sweater with a brim. Shout out to Two Roads Hat Company. These are like the best hats in the game for an amazing freaking price. They sent this piece over to me because we collaborate on Shint. The link will be in the description. You gotta see the prices on these hats. They're absolutely apeshit crazy. Yo, I don't know if Luke Zion sleeps. I feel like this dude goes to sleep with like a magazine with all silver chains with different varieties and shit. When I thought you can find all kinds of Francos, motherfucker comes out and pulls out another one out of his ass. A Pave style Franco. Let's roll my motherfucking music so we can take a look at this chain cause yeah. I'm kind of a big deal. My beautiful people, you know who it is, it's your boy, c 3 3 b 3 a Also known as a Forcentina chain. Never heard of it. I'm not the dude to sit here in front and be like, yeah, nah, I've seen these shit since 1994, when never seen it. He showed it to me and I'm like, what? I, I need to see this in person because I just, it doesn't register in my brain of how, what? Where are you finding these things, bro? Today's video is sponsored by Luke Zion. Shout out to Luke Zion for sending me this piece. And of course, Luke Zion is always gracious enough to send you guys a piece as well. He loves you guys and always sends you guys a little love. And at the end of the video, we will be doing that giveaway because Luke Zion is giving one of you guys the opportunity to have one of these for free 99. So I took this joint out of the bag right before the video. And I was like, yo, First thing that caught my attention before the actual chain was the lock. The way the endpoints of this lock and lobster class meet give it this little level of classy look that I feel more changed to try to incorporate this look. Here is the four millimeter, I believe this is 24 inch or maybe 26? Pave style Franco, AKA four centina link. Now I will have to do some close-up shots because this does not really pick up the detail of these little nicks all over the chain. They're not necessarily diamond cuts. It looks more like gator skin material. Like when you see a nice gator wallet, that's what it kind of looks like. And look at the locking mechanism that I'm talking about. Look at the end caps and then that lobster. It's got a nice, bold 925 made in Italy. Really sturdy, nice, thick end caps. Really like the look of these joints. This Franco is not a rounded off one. It's more of a square style with what I like to look at it as gator print, kind of like a pebbled leather gator style look. Let me show you some up close shots so you can see. Take a look at the detail on this chain. You see that it looks kind of like a marble or pebble look on leather, but not necessarily diamond cuts. It looks more like a marbling or a gator skin material. So this Forcentina chain or Pave style Franco, very, very interesting, very sturdy, very pretty, very artistic, has a little bit of detail. I don't know if this little Pave style or this print or marbling or whatever the fuck they want to call it, really adds any kind of shine factor to it. I think it's just more of a design aesthetic that really just adds an element of kind of artistic value to it. Beautiful, white, shiny sterling silver. It always has that just super, super clean white look. Man, these Italians, they do shit right. And look how pretty these fucking end caps are, like I stated, 925 Italy, high polish, just a handsome piece. Very unique, very different adds an element of flair to the variety of Frankos that are out there in the industry. I give props where props are due. This is a very funky, beautiful white chain that is just as shiny as all other 925 silver Frankos. So I personally don't feel it adds an extra element of shine, but this big boy size really does command some sort of presence around the neck. And that little print, I don't think it's something that you can really tell from a distance, to be honest with you, unless it's laying on one of the flat sides. 
of this squarish type piece, but up close the detail, it's not cheap. I'm trying to like see if I can kind of squeeze it to bend it off, you know, just in case. We all got to check and make sure everything's all copacetic, almost 55 grams, and like a nice level of malleability for a Franco. It's got a really nice malleability to it. It, it feels like somebody trying to recruit me into a silver cult. Every time this kid and I collaborate on some video, it feels like you're drawing me into the silver cult community. These shits just keep getting more and more interesting. And for such an affordable piece of jewelry, like it commands a fucking presence for you white gold fans or you silver aficionados. I'm excited for y'all. It's a lot of fun shit out there that makes it really entertaining for y'all. Like I'm slowly becoming a daily wear kind of convert when it comes to these silver pieces. I've caught myself this week wearing silver Twice. Twice. That's unheard for me. That's unheard of. I haven't worn this piece yet. Wow. Let me see. I'm going to pull the collar up and try to see how it looks outside just to get that neck profile look. I'm going to wear it outside like a weirdo. And this is outside of a sweater. This is definitely like maybe even more than 24 inches. Man, this looks stupid as hell. It's a nice piece. Again, from a distance, you're not going to see that print that I'm talking about. But up close. Neck profile. And from a distance, it does command a presence. It's a very handsome chain. And Luke Zion was gracious enough, as always, to bless you guys with a three millimeter version of this that'll be shipped to you at no cost to you. Once again, I've reminded you guys in the past, there's a lot of WhatsApp scammers, Telegram scammers, all this shit using my face. It's not me. You don't have to pay for anything. I don't need nothing from you. You will only see Cubano, Loco, no phone number, no WhatsApp, no Telegram, nothing else but me telling you if you won based on the random comment selector that I use. I will be the one messaging you. Do not listen to WhatsApp, Telegram, nothing. It's all a scam. Only see si Cuba no loco. That's it. That's it. No point, no one, no phone number, no WhatsApp, no OnlyFans, nothing. Shout out to Luke Zion for sponsoring today's video, blessing me and blessing y'all. And I'll see y'all bitches next time. Let me know what you think of this pave style franco and have you seen anything like this before and i hope luke keeps bringing on these crazy silver pieces because i'm having fun smooches Fly gun holder, money folder, roller roller, star tag when it's time to call back. For the rough, rugged, and raw way, this nigga Jay, it's a game, but he don't play. Hey. For all the chicks that got dead in the penthouse suite on top of my mom's crib. Hey. It's long since you never get in. It's long since that you would think that you would. <laughs>